What's up guys, what's going on? Canbot coming at you with a review. As you can see, Nike, uh, newer box. A little swoosh action going on. Turn it up so you can see the size. They are a 10.5, sorry for the lighting, just a little bit. Nike Air Max 97. You guys are aware this is the 20th anniversary of Nike Air Max 97. So we haven't really seen a lot of shoes come from Nike considering it's the 20th anniversary as far as Air Max 97s go. Let's just leave the idea of them not putting a lot of shoes out because it's Nike and they put out shoes every week but uh, as far as 97 goes they don't put out a lot and I'm a little confused but it is what it is they are a size 10 and a half in the all-white Python snakeskin whatever you want to call them price is $170 which is a little steep but we'll get into it and I'll tell you why I think it's steep in a second uh, cut scene real quick and we'll get into the shoe all right I probably should have used a black background considering the shoe is all white but I'm already here so let's get into it I'm gonna try and bring a little bit closer so the lighting helps me out in this review as you can see the mudguard area across the lower portion of the shoe has a synthetic python the 170 questionable price point is where i question it this is not the best material for 170 dollars you can see there's maybe you can't see it i can see it a little bit of glue staining against that synthetic business all along the uh the separation between the midsole and the mudguard so that, that's a little frustrating to me plus it feels cheap it feels very cheap it, it, i don't know Sometimes they do like uh, an embroidery kind of deal. This is just, it just, it's, it feels like plastic because it's synthetic and I guess that's the problem. Uh, especially when I look at the um, the Supreme, I, I, I don't know, it, it just, the Supreme had scales on it and even the patent leather was a better effect, but at, at least like the gray pair had scales and it felt nice. This is just shit. But either way, let's get into the rest of it. So you got a little, a little mesh hit. Uh, towards the center portion here with a mini swoosh. The upper area is where the shoe really shines. So you got a couple of layers of uh, leather again, just above the mud guard, another canvas hit in the all white, and then you got your 3M striping towards the uppermost portions of the waves. Uh, definitely dope, that's the best part. A little camera action, a little flash action, definitely looks pretty dope. Uh, other than that, there's really not much to talk about. Your air unit all the way across the entire thing as an Air Max 97 should. Outsole is a different sail color as opposed to the white and the upper portion of the midsole. You got one set of lace which is a nylon rope going through the whole thing. Uh, mesh underlay on the tongue, uh, leather piping going across the rest of the area. I don't think that's 3M though, is it? It may be 3M though, it looks like leather. Feels like leather. I could be a little off. That might be a 3M hit up here as well. I haven't done a flash picture yet, but I could be off. I'll take one and I'll probably throw a note up here if it is 3M or not. Uh, white footbed. Pull tab in white, everything is white on the shoe. If you need a nice white summer shoe, this is definitely one to go with. Um, this might have been an impulse buy, not gonna lie to you. <laughs> Sizing 10.5 is definitely a little bit fuller, so you can go TTS or 0.5 down, depending. Uh, this isn't like an Air Max one where you need to go true to size. I, I definitely uh, have a little bit of room in these on my size 11, so as you guys are aware, as always, my left foot is a size 11, these are 10.5, and, and I still have a little bit of room, so they definitely run a little fuller. Uh, if you need sizing options. Other than that, I'll do an on foot for you guys. And uh, yeah, so if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions, comments, hit me in the comment section. If there's anything else you guys need to talk about or want to know about or see me do a review on, let me know. And uh, I pick back up on the vlog, so definitely go back and check some of those out. If you haven't yet, I'll be doing a couple more while it's still warm out. And uh, I think I'm out of here. Peace.